Alright, the Shark Eye on RV720. Test in clean mode with a lot of obstacles in the room. They recommend you pick up everything to have the best cleaning, but this is how life is with a toddler and a baby. Stuff all over the floor. Well, not this bad, but you know how it is, parents out there. Put down the strip that they included to keep it out of certain areas. It's just a magnetic strip that tells it uh, not to cross it. It's <clears throat> having a little fun on that wall there. That uh, table's a little higher than normal tables, so fits under there pretty nice. There's the boundary strip, see what it does. That's like a plastic little play thing. If it was cloth, I would pick it up. It would get stuck in the, the vacuum. Navigated this wall a little better. The brushes seem to be going pretty close to the wall. See the brush touching the edge of the wall, which is nice. Pulling dirt in. Made it over the vent.
This probably gives you a pretty good idea of what it can do. I'll come back a little bit later. Alright, I managed to get itself stuck under the big wheel so you can get out. Hey, I was able to get out. So I'm going to go back for in for more. <laughs> there we go. I assume it's just going to clean for the 60 minute run time it has or however long the battery lasts and then return to the docking station when it gets to a certain point. I don't think it knows where it's, like if it's missed any part of the room. It doesn't have that kind of logic. Here's a close-up of the remote that comes with it. At this point I'm going to hit uh, dock. I'm gonna cheat a little bit. Mm. There's its home. Oh. Thanks for watching.